Serena is furious as Megan sold her body to Brett Ratner to get the role. Welcome back to our channel, dear viewers, please remember to subscribe and let's stay in touch. Megan is said to have engaged in a multi-day affair with Brett Ratner in her pursuit of a role in the movie Horrible Bosses, even while he was in a relationship with Serena. The traditional tale of Megan's rise to fame portrays her as a struggling actress who stumbled into the limelight after attending an upscale party. However, it's important to note that this narrative is far from accurate. As we delve into the details, be prepared for a revelation of the layers of falsehood woven into her story. Upon closer examination, it's fascinating to revisit earlier videos armed with our current insights. In these clips, Megan can be observed meticulously shaping a fabricated public persona through varying recollections of her improbable journey into acting, particularly in an interview from August 2012. During this interview, Megan appears somewhat caught off guard when asked about her activities five years prior, around the 2012 mark. Her responses take a somewhat comical turn as she hastily puts forth various claims. She asserts that her involvement in the film industry began five years earlier, which would place it around 2007. She suggests she graduated from college, briefly worked at the Argentinian embassy, and then embarked on her acting journey in 2007. She insinuates that she might have leaned towards a political career had acting not beckoned, and that her discovery happened at a party. According to her narrative, a friend presented her with a man's student film, opening the doors to her cinematic pursuits. Despite Megan's apparent assertions of self-reliance, her father, Thomas Markle, asserts that he financed every step of her education journey. Contrary to her claims, her initial career path lacked glamour and was backed by her father's financial support. In actuality, her career trajectory had its roots in a more modest and pragmatic reality. Following a five-week embassy internship in 2022 during her studies, a common experience for many students, she returned to college and earned her degree in mid-2003. The subsequent years were marked by her fervent efforts to establish herself as an actress. Megan's assertions of her imminent entry into politics are contradicted by historical evidence. Around five years prior to the 2012 interview, in 2007, Megan was grappling with her aspirations as an actress and working as a briefcase girl. She had graduated nearly a decade earlier than her stated timeline, and from 2003 onward, she faced the struggles of an aspiring actress, enduring a decade marked by challenges and limited job opportunities. Intriguingly, Megan's attempt to shave five years off her age surfaces in her narrative. Let's now delve into Brett Ratner. Some sources suggest that Megan might have used questionable tactics to secure a role in Horrible Bosses, potentially involving Ratner in this endeavor. Ratner, a figure known for controversial business practices, has purportedly leveraged movie roles in exchange for certain personal favors. This prompts us to inquire whether Megan indeed became entangled in this web of deception. Was she truly ensnared in a complex network of deceit? Furthermore, reports indicate that Megan's involvement with Brett Ratner extended beyond professional connections. Allegedly, Megan engaged in a romantic liaison with Ratner while he was dating her supposed best friend, Serena Williams. It's speculated that this period marked the inception of their friendship, although Serena has chosen to avoid discussing this chapter of her life. Adding a flashback to earlier research, there are claims that Megan was involved with Brett Ratner and Harvey Weinstein in a casual and transactional manner, offering companionship and intimacy. Interestingly, she reportedly demanded compensation from a particular producer-turned-government official for similar interactions. One can't help but wonder how Serena feels about these revelations, especially considering Megan's subsequent pursuit of a marriage and her entry into the world of tennis.